Hey Skip, did you hear what happened to the CEO of Lydia Inc? He's been charged over all the dodgy stuff they do in their games. Mate, who do you think it even was who suggested they have an agent posed as a homeless guy? Wait, that was your idea? Yeah mate, I actually even suggested that they should make him creepy and suggest self-promotions as a sort of inside joke while the sting was going on. But what do you mean by inside joke? Ah, I'm glad you asked mate. You see, they often refer to this person as creepy homeless guy from the ladies room, but they didn't seem to notice the fact that his power at the company was slowly creeping up, much like power creep within a game. Ah, 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 ah. That's pretty clever, mate. I'm glad I thought of it. Anyway, shut up for a second and ask you a ridiculous question for this episode. But how do you know I was even going to ask something? Mate, every single episode, you go, Hey, mate. Can I ask you a serious question for a second? Oh, true. Mate, if you had the power to make any changes to Jurassic World Alive and add it into patch 1.9, what would the changes be? Ah, I'm glad you asked, mate. You see, I would first start by taking the person responsible for creating the rat, the boost system. Oh, and that person who thought the Packy hybrid model was a good idea? That person too. Then, I would get a whole bunch of Jurassic World Alive players together, and then let them lynch them. However, as for the actual game changes, I would pretty much just undo everything that patch 1.7 and 1.8 added, and then just re-release patch 1.6 as 1.9. Pretty sure it would universally be considered the best change ever. That's actually pretty impressive that you can improve a game by removing all the improvements. Anyway, mate, what would you do to improve the game? Ah, I'm glad you asked, mate. Oi, that's my line. Anyway, I would change the arena so that it's not such a sewer. That way all the rats wouldn't feel so at home. And the other change I would make would actually be just rat swapping attack. I'd change it from being swap in rampage to a new move called swap in, swap out. That way when all the max boosted sewer rats swap in, they instantly swap out, doing no damage in the process. Mate, that is literally the Best friggin' idea I've ever heard! Oh, by the way, mate, there was a couple of members on the forums, and they seem to be constantly defending all this strategy. They're even going as far as saying it requires skill and even a thought process. What do you have to say to those members? Mate, all I have to say is that if swapping in a dinosaur and then instantly swapping it out again is what's considered skill-based strategy, I honestly weep for Arena.